Welcome to Housekeeping Tips with Cher. Blessings from me to you. Uh, today we will be cleaning our refrigerator. As you can see, I already unpacked the, uh, the stuff that was in there. Uh, normally, I don't do this. I don't unpack anything to clean the refrigerator. I clean as I go along. Later on, I'll show you how I get that done. Okay, I'll be using my cloth, my rag, and there's some my bleach bottle here. I have two. I have a spray one that I use for the bathroom and other places. And I have this that I use in the kitchen. So I'm going to start by cleaning the door, the shelves rather, cleaning the shelves, OK? So I use, I put a little piece of scotch bright in the, uh, on the rag, uh, just in case there are spots that the rag cannot take out, then this will help to get it out, okay? So, as I go along, I will be doing this. The only thing I did not take out was the cheese, the cheese is on this, so I fix them, and then I can go in there, clean it out. my rag. So we rub. See, there are a lot of spots need to be rubbed. Yeah. Okay, I use some of my bleach and I pour it like this and I rub. See? This, as I said, you don't have to take out everything to get it clean. And the best time, I think if you want to take out everything and get it clean, I think it would be best like close to the end of the month when it's a bit, you know, empty, not a lot of stuff. So you don't have a lot of stuff to take out. All right. So we continue to scour, continue to rub, not scour, rub. And then I go here and I rub. So we make sure we do our shelves. Okay. And then I'm going to rest this right here and I'm going to use this. I'm going to clean this. So we can rub it. We go along, we see we're rubbing out the spots, whatever spots is there. Rub it, and we go down here. Right, see? And we're gonna wash our rag out, okay? So. I'm washing my rag out and I use my bleach to do my cleaning. Once I have bleach, I don't need anything else for me, okay? All those clean agent, if you want to use them, you can go ahead, but I use my bleach and my rag. That's what I use to clean up. As long as I have bleach, I'm good, okay? So. I do this. Okay. And we clean, it's all nice and clean now. Okay, so that that's the shelf. Okay, we're gonna go inside here. These are the our trays. So we no, normally at the bottom we have the glass. 
okay, I'm going to take this out. So you're going to have to be very careful. See? Very careful. And I'm going to put it inside here because we're going to wash it. You know, so I'm going to wash it right now so it will drain while I'm cleaning the fridge, the inside. So, we're rubbing it, and I'm using the scotch brand to rub it. Just to rub it gently, you gotta have to be careful, okay? Remember, it's glass, okay? And I'm gonna turn it, and I'm gonna wash the other side, like this. Okay, so we can wash it. And then after we wash it, we're just gonna leave it to drain. So when we finish it side, then we'll have we need to have it ready, okay? Okay, so we're gonna leave it to drain. And then we gotta wash our rag out. And then we go, we're gonna go inside. Now this is a, a water purifier, right? Uh, you know that he comes, we uh, normally, we, help, we pour the water in the pipe, the tap water, and then we use our filter, okay? I prefer to drink my water like this. As a matter of fact, I prefer this than even the bottle of water. However, I don't know what you like, but this is what I like. Okay, we're gonna continue cleaning, so I'm just gonna put some um, bleach, okay, on my rag, on this, and I'm gonna go down here first. So you get a scour here. Okay, where the glass used to be. We gotta rub it. Okay, let me, I'm gonna go down on my knees. Ugh, Cause I wanna get onto here, okay? So. Oh. I'm gonna get down and clean onto here. Put the rag in. I'm gonna pour it all here because I want these little corners, yeah. Right, so okay. And this is this is our scotch right, so we're gonna use it for these little area. These are stuck, so I cannot get them out. But in your refrigerator, at least you can take them out, okay, when you're cleaning. Every little corner, right? This, we rub it. See our little corners? And we rub it on this. These are long time refrigerators, so. Yes, uh, <clears throat> you have the modern ones, so you can take all of these out when you're cleaning it. And as I said, you don't have to do this all the time. Maybe once a month you can empty the refrigerator and, you know, give it this deep clean. 
but I'll show you what you can do to maintain it. Okay, I'm gonna use my rag. And I'm gonna go clean. Yeah. Wipe off our shelves. And we go on to here. Oh, here. Okay. We also wipe this off. Oh. Especially, you know, we gotta, you know, touch it and thing like that. So we want to clean off everything that we touch. We want to wipe them off. And then I'm going to get up and I'm going to wash my rag. Wash my rag out. There you go. And then I'm just going to run the rag over this. So we have our fridge all clean. This, I'm going to put some of the bleach on the, on the rag. And I'm going to wipe here. This is where we hold a lot. So I just, you do this. Clean it off. I clean off the top. I'm going to put it in the corner. So I clean off the top. And I clean it down with my bleach okay so we clean all of this down now I'm gonna put it in my glass okay okay so I'm gonna dry it off now, normally I have my dry rag, my buffer that I use to shine these things off because we don't want to waste our toilet, uh, sorry, our paper towel. So I don't normally use the paper towel. I have rags that I use. So we're going to clean this off and we're going to hold it gently and we're going to put it right side like this. Remember it's glass so we're gonna be careful and there we go see okay these are trays no normally our onions you know we have we have onions and this is what happens some people put like paper in it or whatever they put it you know just to let it neat for me I don't normally do that because I have to clean it very often the tray especially when you have the onions so what I'll do, I'll wash it out. See? And this is why I said that it's best to clean, give it the deep clean that you're giving it. It's best to do it at the, maybe closer to the end of the month when you have less stuff in there, okay? This way you don't have all of these things to pack the pat back inside there. Okay. Okay, so I finished this one. And I'm gonna dry it. I'm gonna dry it like this. See, I clean it all off. And I'm gonna put it right under here. See, put it back where it belongs. There we go. I put it right back where we belong. 
And then we have this one. I'm going to wash this one out. Okay, we just want to get the dust and the onion uh, trash off it, okay? The trash off the onions. Okay. And as I said, I'm going to show you how we maintain it. And we don't have to do this as often as you think it should. If you do what I do. Okay, this is it. So we're going to wipe that down. Okay. Okay, so we're going to put our stuff back in. So we, we have Ziploc. Big lock bags, onions, and these are the onions. So we're gonna put that on some in this, put it nicely, and some in this. Okay, and there you go. Then I'm gonna put these in. Hello. So when you go when you go shopping now, when you come in, you don't have to think about cleaning the refrigerator because it's already clean. So you just pack your stuff in. Okay. These, we're going to put these in the tray. Uh, these, we're going to put them in the shelf right here. Right here. Okay. These. Uh, put there. Oh, this is my coffee. Not me. I don't drink coffee. I keep it in the place. I'm not the coffee drinker. These, we keep them here. Here. Oh, we have these. I'm going to shoot those right there. And these, we put them in the the tray on the here. Okay. I guess you can leave them up the way you want. You know, put them in Ziploc, Ziploc bags and fix them nicely there. Okay. I'm just showing you after cleaning. That's it. And that it. Okay, we can put this butter here. That. Okay, I said I promised I was going to hold there some other stuff here. These, put them in. Um, baking soda, I put it into a little Ziploc bag. Uh, we always have ba key baking soda in our refrigerator. I, I'm not sure. Some people say it's, it makes it fresh, the refrigerator fresh, so... I guess I'll do that. I keep it in. I put it at the bottom. These are my garlic. Okay. Okay, what I want to show you. Okay. This is finished, okay? What I what I want to show you. Let me take a sip of my ginger tea. Well. Okay, what I want to show you like this. I'm I'm making my tea, okay, and I come in the refrigerator for something. Now, I come in and I see this. Look at this. The kids or the, the, my daughter, and she make a mess. What I do, I clean it all off, clean it off, see? Clean it off. Close it. Um... They use the jam. Remember, you're not around the kids. So when you come in, because, you know, you come in, to, in the refrigerator time to time, okay? Uh, they use a the syrup. Oh, we wipe it off. You don't have to wait until you said, oh, I need to give the house a deep clean. That is why it becomes very stressful. Because guess what? These are just simple little things. You come in and there's a spot here. I wipe it off. Um, the onions. Oh, I just take this out. Clean it out and put this back. Good, and I'm good. This, I see a spot here. 
I clean off the spot, okay? I don't wait until when it's once a month or whenever I'm gonna clean, and then you, you gotta have more spot, more. So each time you, you come in in the mornings, and you're gonna have your cup of tea or something, and you're in the kitchen, um, I'm around the table, and you know your eyes looking all over, and you said, oh, that need to be, to be wiped off. And I wipe it off, and I'm having my tea, right? Um, I'm cooking, um, I go in the refrigerator, and I see something needs to be, you know, some little things, cause I, especially when you have the kids. I don't have any young kids now, right? But when you have the young kids and they go in there, they do little things and, you know, so when you as the adult go in there into the refrigerator and you see all these little things, you just wipe them off and then guess what? You don't have to be worrying about, Lord, I have to do this. You do it because you want to do it. But then it's not a must because it's clean. Okay, so we close our fridge. This, I can't be bothered to take off everything. So what I do, I do like this. These, these are from kid, kiddies day, the children. Okay, so what I do, I clean it up, this off. Now this, it holds, I clean this off every day because this is something you have to hold. So what I do, I do like this. Clean it off because I hold it every day. And I do this. Yeah? I just push this aside because I can't be bothered to take them off. So I just do this. This, same thing. Same thing with this. I clean it off. Can't be bothered every time that I'm gonna have to take this off. Sometimes you see a little spot here or here. I just get my rag. My rag is always here. So I get my rag and I see that little spot and I clean it off like this. Okay? So that way it doesn't back up. See? You can't be bought up. So I just put one side and I clean this side. And then I go back and I clean the other side. Now I can put this back. And then I can do this. See? I do this. It, they all go now. My youngest child is 13. Still has to monitor her. Yeah, enforce tidiness with her. So, see, clean. Okay. And then when I finish, now I take my mop. And I sweep up, see the onion thing right there? I sweep up. And this way, I don't have to, you know, be stressed out about housework. Trust me, housework is, is cool. It is so cool. Uh, I'm having my tea, and I'm cleaning my refrigerator. Yes? And um, there are other things I could do. I sit here. And there are things I, I see, like if I see other things, I'll just do it. I don't wait. I don't back them up, okay? I do not back them up. So this is, um, <clears throat> as I said, this is our refrigerator, clean and nice. Uh, you can go ahead and do your neatness, whatever way you want it. And as I said, when, they, when we see things like these, use and we see little things on them, we wipe them off, okay? This... They use it, wipe it off, any little spot, the onions, uh, uh, thing, trash or whatever. You empty this, empty it in that, clean it up, and you put it back. And that way, as I said, at the end of the month, if you wish to do a deep clean, then you can do it, okay? If you like this video, share, subscribe, and like, please. Thank you.